create this spring skull makeup look, I started out by sponging pastel colours all over my face. I then went into a black face paint and painted in the hollows of the skull eyes and a skull nose. I then painted in the basic lines of the jaw bones and then I went down onto the neck and started painting in the neck and chest bones. I wanted to paint some big spring daisies across the chest area so I just started to paint those in before I finished up joining the rib cage. I went into this Cryvaline split cake palette and I used the white colour to paint the petals of the daisies and then I went into this like really nice green split cake to paint the leaves. started to paint in the ribcage area and I did this a bit like randomly and kind of tie dye pastel it and I did start with the like purple and blue colours at the top and then I went down to the more pinks and yellows. I then painted the whole area around the flowers and the ribcage with a black face paint. I then went into a black face paint and I just painted these tree silhouettes um, up one side of the face and I just added these like silhouettes of flowers on the end of the branches just to kind of give it more of a spring feel. This skull is like part of a kind of a series I've done and I've done like all the different seasons so I'll pop in a picture of the other ones now and this is the final one and it's spring and I've finished them all now so I just tried to like kind of make it look as springy as possible painting these little white clouds in as well I then went into this black paint on a super fine brush and I painted a few of these butterfly silhouettes onto the face and then I also used this same brush to add some little cracks in the skull. I then went into a black eyeshadow and I started to shade around the skull areas to make it look a bit more 3D. Then using a white face paint I started to highlight around all the edges, so around the edges of the eyes and nose and jaw and this just adds to the three dimensional effect. I painted white dots in the sky to look like little stars and I also added some star bursts and a crescent moon as well in the centre of my forehead. painted on the outline of the teeth using a black paint and a fine brush and then with the teeth I did kind of a similar effect as I did on the chest area where I did kind of like a tie-dye like mishmash of the different colours. I added a black curl liner to the waterline and then I 
put some yellow eyeshadow on my eyelids and I just blended in the black with the black eyeshadow to give it, it give it like a smooth gradient. Then went into this neon UV yellow paint and I just kind of painted over some of the areas where I'd added the white highlights because I don't know it gives it quite a cool effect it gives it like a bit of a sunset glow around the edges so I just yeah added that like all over the different highlighted areas And this is the finished look of my spring skull makeup. This is also going to be my entry into the NYX Face Awards UK and Ireland. So wish me luck and let's hope I get through again. Thank you for watching this tutorial. If you like it, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Have a great day. Bye.